What's up everybody, Britton Peel here for DallasNews.com to give you a quick rundown of some of the bigger, nerdier news of the week. Star Wars Episode 7 finally has a subtitle. It was announced with surprisingly little warning or fanfare when the official Star Wars Twitter account tweeted that Star Wars The Force Awakens has completed principal photography, as if we all knew that title already. Now the internet could have begun intense speculation about what the title means. Why was the Force asleep? Why is it waking up now? But instead, people took to social media to do what they do best, make dumb jokes. After a few hundred people suggested that the Force might need a cup of coffee, the Twitter hashtag RejectedStarWarsTitles took off, resulting in some pretty funny fake names. That wasn't the only big movie news, because Disney and Pixar decided to confirm that Toy Story 4 will be hitting theaters in 2017. John Laster, who directed the first two movies, will be returning to helm this one. He told the LA Times that this fourth movie will be a love story and that it will take place where Toy Story 3 left off. Nothing has been said about whether signature voices of Tom Hanks or Tim Allen would return, but come on. I can't imagine this project will be greenlit without them on board. Lastly, Nintendo decided to air one of their live Nintendo Direct videos this week to highlight a bunch of upcoming 3DS and Wii U games. There were some tidbits of information dropped and some release dates revealed, but the company started the show with a showstopper by announcing The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3D for the Nintendo 3DS. The original game on the Nintendo 64 is sort of a love it or hate it game for the popular series, but a lot of fans have been very vocal about their desire for a remake, and it looks like Nintendo is finally going to give them what they want. For more geek news and video game reviews, be sure to check out DallasNews.com geek. See you next week.